In a world where the Holy Trinity consists of meatballs, lingonberry jam, and flat pack furniture, there exists a sacred text revered by millions, the IKEA catalog. Yes, you heard it right. Move over Bible. Step aside Quran for the humble Swedish furniture giants catalog is here to give you a run for your money. With more than 203 million copies distributed worldwide, the IKEA catalog isn't just a booklet of furniture listings, it's a cultural phenomenon. It has infiltrated homes across the globe, nestled between coffee tables and forgotten receipts, its glossy pages promising a world of minimalist bliss and unassembled frustration. So, what makes this catalog so divine? Well, for starters, it's not just a catalog, it's a journey. Flipping through its pages is like embarking on an odyssey through the labyrinth of Scandinavian design. Each turn reveals a new marvel, a sleek sofa, a stylish lamp, or a bookshelf so deceptively simple, you'll end up with 10 leftover screws and a headache. But it's not just about the furniture. No, dear reader, the IKEA catalog offers much more. It's a beacon of hope for those lost souls wandering the aisles of indecision. Stuck in a rut. Not sure if you need a mom or a hems. Fear not, for the catalog is here to guide you, offering solutions to all of life's problems. Well, at least the ones involving storage and organization. And let's not forget the names. Ah, the names, a linguistic puzzle wrapped in an enigma. How does one pronounce Björkvik? Is Granlet even a real word? The IKEA catalog challenges us to expand our vocabulary and test the limits of our linguistic capabilities. After all, who needs Latin when you can fluently speak Swedish furniture? But perhaps the true genius of the IKEA catalog lies in its ability to unite us all. Regardless of race, religion, or economic status, we can all bond over the shared experience of trying to assemble a Billy bookcase without losing our sanity. It's a testament to the human spirit, or perhaps just a testament to the power of Allen wrenches. Of course, no holy text is without its skeptics. Some may scoff at the notion of elevating a furniture catalog to the status of religious scripture. But to them, I say this, have you ever tried navigating an IKEA store on a weekend? It's a spiritual experience in itself, complete with long lines, crying children, and the faint scent of Swedish meatballs wafting through the air. In conclusion, while the IKEA catalog may not offer salvation in the traditional sense, it certainly brings joy, frustration, and a touch of whimsy into our lives. So the next time you find yourself perusing its pages, take a moment to appreciate the wonder of it all. And remember, when all else fails, there's always duct tape. Praise be to IKEA. Amen.